Hello everyone, welcome to my channel and it's me again Angelica and today the video is going to be about sneak peek what I already purchased from new releases, what I was this close to purchase but I didn't and we're just going to talk what is coming up, what is the sneak peek, what is excited, what is not and you're going to tell me what you already purchased or you're thinking to purchase please let me know in the comment below and by any chance if you don't know me my name is angelica i'm also a dance instructor who loves to dance and teach and my channel it's not just about a colorful makeup i'm just want to drink this uh, cappuccino and i didn't have a time anyway so my channel is not just about colorful makeup with a new touch and if you're wondering what palette i use today it's cosmic brushes uh, cosmetics and this is beautiful wonderland palette really beautiful really enjoying every time i use this palette i'm just saying wow look at this color story such a gorgeous uh, palette and i've been already wearing this makeup since morning and now it's evening so you can tell this palette is very pigment it doesn't really go anywhere it, it's just beautiful it's just look like i just did it right now this makeup also my channel is about the skincare and please check it out on my latest video about skincare i just going to put a link over here also i'm going to uh, put my link in description box it's about a lot of k beauty i do korean beauty and also about the new technology because korean beauty are really really booming right now and i really see my difference about my uh, skin routine at home also if you're interested what i do uh, for my skin you can also check it out other my skin routine where i'm actually doing microneedling showing you how i do it where to do and so on so on explain everything also what is uh, my channel about it's about traveling I am actually going to travel very soon to Aruba again and I'm going to do a new video because we're going to stay in a different villa and we're going to go to some restaurant maybe the one I already have been but definitely I'm going to try some new restaurant just trying to go to see uh, explore Aruba more so if you're interested check it out uh, my video so please subscribe to see it in the future and also my channel it's about hairstyle and i did so many hairstyles with my daughter she's 12 and a half years old so you're more than welcome to watch our full tutorial or just a short which literally will take you one minute and the last things what i do it's a rating of restaurant and all of them is in my shorts wherever i travel or here in toronto if you're interested please don't forget to subscribe and like and that's it what i do in my channel let's start to talk about sneak peek what already released or what i already bought and what just is interesting going on in the beauty industry so let's start okay the first things but it's not that new but it's new in the market uh, it, the nasa myrick release a yummy skin leaf flex hydrating concealer with hyaluronic acid and caffeine so i already ordered i didn't try yet i'm going to try it with you look how small is it so i was at the beginning i was like is it this is it is it mini size or what but when i check the milligrams it's 9.4 milligrams normally like for example i have l'oreal true match which i absolutely love it and very affordable it's actually have one and a half percent also hyaluronic acid with caffeine actually the same ingredients wow now <laughs> it's very curious so i am in love with this one very affordable so i'm looking forward to try also it has vitamin e but this yes. is a serum hybrid complexion improving formula flexes and moves with your skin it was visibly smooth and correct all area of the face with a soft matte finish so i think between these two is different I think this is more for the dry skin, I would say combined skin. This is for all kind of skin type, even for oily skin. So if you're looking for something maybe a less creamy, I think this is going to be, I didn't try, but by description, I can tell you this is more for the dry skin type. 
which I absolutely love it because I have dry combined skin and also I bought shade number six and it was between six and four because they didn't have in the store so I just bought it from like online trying to match so it said neutral and we will see if I did a good choice or I should go for the lighter shade so this is more I would say light medium the four it's more I think a lighter uh by two shades basically but it's also neutral i always go with a neutral because that's what it's really match me the best and its price is 30 dollars american dollars you can definitely in canada you only can buy online so what else it has so it's lift and correct it said so also it's have cushy extract centella asiatica uh, goji berry extract and uh, vegan correct pigments and it's also aloe extract vegan squalane orchid flower extract yeah echinacea extract, and vitamin e so basically they have a lot of good ingredients maybe l'oreal has less ingredients i'm not sure what i see is just have a hyaluronic acid and caffeine but that's also was a main ingredients what is said right on front we're going to try i can't tell you anything my opinion about that but stay tuned i'm going to do a video using that and another thing which is uh, also uh, pretty new in the market is makeup by mario and a soft sculpt multi-use bronzing shaping serum and i also purchased i didn't try it i i purchased the medium uh, color because I think it's very serumy and very kind of like a transparent so I decided to go with a darker normally I will buy like a medium light but I went for a medium and uh, what is said about this first of all it has a pump and also it has a wand over here so you can use in two different ways so you can really go and bronze yourself or you can just pump and just mix with foundation or use it. I don't think you can use it by itself, but I think you can use it underneath your foundation or mix with foundation. Let's see what they say, what they describe. So it's coverage is light, finish is natural, and let's see how to use it. So it said for a sun skin glow, use the pump to apply all, all over the face. Might you recommend that blending with the F4 brush? Okay. For a targeted soft sculpt effect, use the wand applicator to shape and enhance your features. So that's what I said. So you can use it by itself or you can sculpt yourself whatever you want to do as a bronzer. Also, this formula is flexible and versatile that you can lay over foundation. So over foundation, okay. Or use alone or bare skin. Mm -hmm. You only need one to two layers to achieve an effortless soft bronzing effect okay so we're going to try that i think my preference probably will be uh using foundation and then put on top of it and then maybe try to do like a bronzing we will see so you and it said shake it before you use so very curious i uh, heard a good stuff about that so i'm looking forward to use it with you and see and you know my idea also uh compare i know it's probably it's really different it's like a day and night but i want to try uh compare with l'oreal uh glow one which i like it i also have a medium color so let's see let's do experiments okay there is another release which i am actually a uh, very interested in this release but i am scared to buy it because i'm going to travel and i don't think this time maybe when i come back i'll purchase we will see Diti cosmetics so they're going to release a collection of and 12th of july for the most iconic sparkly shifty eyeshadow that we have even created as a brand including our glitz glam collection what is going to have eight high intensity metallic multichrome which is 16.99 each this is pretty, you know, it's, this is how it's cost basically when I'm purchasing something from Cleona. I think it's a little bit less than that or for Adopt Cosmetic, but they are beautiful. They look gorgeous, but I am interested in 15 pan Chromebook Volume 1.
It's consisting of soft, intense, iridescent, sparkly, shifted or chrome eyeshadow. And the price is 55 American dollar, which I think it's a great price for this kind of, uh, you know, iridescent shades. They look gorgeous. This is me. This is what I wanted. But as I mentioned before, I don't know if I'm going to purchase on release because I'm leaving. I don't know. Maybe a later on. Beauty but Bay released Air uh, palette called Botanical. And it's 20 color palette. 20 shades of greens, apricot, rusts, purple, and grays. Uh, it has a twist in this palette. Uh, I would say it's it's not completely my color story, but I think a lot of people would love it because it's kind of have this uh, not colorful, but not nude. It's something between, which is actually interesting color story. It's not bad at all, but I would say it goes more for the autumn and winter, but it has a tones of the apricots, which is beautiful, greens. So it's probably for people who like more neutral. I wouldn't mind, but I don't think this is something first palette I would love to try from uh, this brand. So, but they are looking very good and very affordable. It's only 22 American dollars in a beauty bay. So I'm looking forward to purchase something from this brand, but, but maybe not exactly uh, this palette. Okay, let's move on. This is so cute. So, uh, Glister Cosmetic releasing a Tilly Tubis comes to help you slay. So, they're using, I remember I was actually showing uh, this Tilly, what they call Tilly, Tilly Tubis for my son when he was little and he was watching them, uh, their cuties, and they was doing a collection with that and they have like a three shade inside and they have half and half of them, so basically you will have six shades there. It's going to release on 12th of July. I have uh, liners for them. I actually um, uh, was long time ago. I make it my personal, you know, how you choose by yourself and create your own palette. So I have my palette with them as a liners, the activated liner. So you activate it with the water. I actually use them time to time. It's actually not bad at all. I like it. It's something different. This brand from UK, uh, they're nice. If you're looking forward for some fun, I think it's a good idea to try this brand. So, okay, Makeup by Mario also releasing extending the shades for Moisturize Glow Plumping Lip Serum. And we have, I think, five shades. Um, and they are gorgeous. It's $24 each. It's already available coming soon available exclusively to, 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 to. I think it's available right now at Sephora not sure but they are looking great uh, like the one is not fully pigmented they're like I would say half pigmented which is I really like it never tried it heard a lot of great things I like that they release more colorful shades because I don't like really nudes so this is something uh, I can check it out Okay, also Makeup by Mario releasing, ex again, extending shades with a soft pop plumping blush. And it's weightless cream blush that is made with hyaluronic acid to hydrate and plump skin with a sheer wheel of colors. And we have extending colors, also colorful. One of them pink, another one like a corally reddish, I would say. Uh, another one is more coral and another one is really, really orangey. Again, very smart move because we're in the summer and we want something really bright, which is, I love it all the year long. Uh, another release from Adept Cosmetics release a limited edition palette, which called Legend of Artra. And it's 75 American dollar and it's already released, I think, or it's going to be released. Yes, it's July 12th. Everything July 12th so far. And we have different color and we have also shade with a different color. Since I have, I think Elements 115 is the same with a different shade, but it has like a lines. And this shade 
a little bit tricky to use and i prefer use them separately because if you use them together it's kind of become like a mixture of one color so i think the same thing with this this color story a little bit appealing for me i would say i wouldn't i wouldn't actually mind it has a pink it has some purple it has goldish color it has kind of like a orangey one i would say uh do i like this color story it's good but it's not a blow me away so i am going to be very strict with myself because i have to really really be careful what i'm buying because i have too many palettes right now uh, Kaylee Cosmetic, uh, it said, she's back. Our sold out transformation lip tint are here to stay in two new shades. They leave a gorgeous glossy pink tint to the lips. And it's already released July 10. Basically, they're extending the, uh, the shades and it's a tint, what I understand. Oh, it's nice. Uh, not interesting in tints, to be honest. I don't know. I think tints normally are dry my lips, but this one look like it's it's glowing i don't know maybe they use on top some oil I have no idea but that's what it is mac uh, release fix plus multitasking setting spray alcohol free hydrates primes sets refreshes and also for 12 hours and it's release i think it's available at mac right now what is all new pump involved to deliver a fine wakeless mist also hydrates and soothing without drying and also infused with green tea and chamomile and cucumber hmm, interesting maybe i can check it out what is it how i like the mist and how i like the smell there is a lot of different sets uh so sephora releasing one of them ends up from glow recipe if you love glow the recipe or you never try i think this is a good chance to do it because it's a kit uh, glow with me kit by katie fang with hue drops tinted serum so what we have there i think that was a popular one uh, it's uh, it's also a travel size trio and it has it has plum plum hyaluronic cream which is 20 ml 40 ml watermelon glow toner 20 ml plum plum hyaluronic cream and 15 ml water watermelon glow niacinamide hue drops and it's only 40 american dollars and it's available at sephora okay hourglass releasing a new unreal liquid blush and this is something interesting i would like to check it out at sephora what is interesting about it because i never see this package before i don't think i see and it's look like it's going to really um uh, come out as a drop because this package it's for something very liquid and it said it's a liquid blush what also it said it's a visibly plump with hydration and delivered unreal buildable color for a neutral finish they stay which stays up to 12 hours interesting infused with hyaluronic acid with white loop and seed extract so it's 36 america dollar it's available at sephora something interesting to try really because it's something different i think it's it's pretty liquidish but it's buildable so let's see if we're going to if people are going to like it if i'm going to like it but really it's good to really check it out at sephora before you make that decision before you going to purchase sugar drizzle releasing a new eyeshadow highlighter single and we see so many covers which is really looks amazing i actually checked that out and i was really close to buy that but i didn't purchase yet i'm thinking i'm still thinking but this is something really interesting pat mcgrath it's sneak peek it doesn't does it show anything it, so it's divine doja stunning backstage moments with uh do doja cat doesn't show what exactly but i think it's a quote it's quote like a four four uh four eyeshadow palette and we see kind of like a grayish with a bluish undertone so something interesting let's see what it's going to be another release but i haven't bought anything from pat mcgraw for a long time i used to buy 
um, a lot of palettes from this but because she become like the same all the time so I stop but this one is look interesting something bluish but again it's pretty expensive let's move on there is a lot of new sets available at Sephora that's one of the sets which catch my eyes from Lawless and this set with a lipstick and a gloss and the both of them what is good is full size and it's 35 uh, can American dollars it's available on Sephora website and I think if you want to try this is a great great uh, opportunity because it's it's a good value of set it's another good set from uh, Danessa Myrick Beauty it's a set no it's a mini mini yummy skin uh, blurring balm powder and uh, universal then mini yummy skin blooming balm powder flushed in rose and blush so there's two mini for only 22 canadian dollars like if you never try and you want to just try to see if you like it i think this is a nice nice set to buy it to check it out okay morphe blushes okay we see now morphe is the same as the hourglass i guess this is going to be a trend right now it's hot shot blush drops so the same thing basically really the same thing so give skin a healthy look uh water weight uh, so but this guys because it's morphe it's cost 14 dollars only i don't know if they're buildable but the colors look amazing so what it said blend for all over flash or build for intensive color so they're buildable so the water weight formula seamlessly melts into skin with natural finish and also give skin infused with ingredients known to hydrate, soothe, and protect your skin. Basically very similar. And also there is another ingredient, niacinamide, glycerin, uh, natural algae, vitamin E, vitamin B5, and advice moisture complex. <laughs> For this price, maybe Morphe, I don't know, maybe it's different with, uh, I guess so, with uh, quality. But who knows? Maybe they are great. So they are available in Alta for 14 American dollars. Bobby Brown. He released Always Love Luke's Matte Liquid Lipstick. So I think right now we're coming to the colder season after summer I'm talking about. So the brand slowly, slowly start to move to the matte lipstick. And one of them is a Bobby Brown. He already released so many colors of matte lipstick is it's 40 american dollars is available now on the official fridges so it's not at sephora yet and what is this features a creamy texture for moisture uh, moisturization and soft matte finish this matte is promising us to be comfortable i know that a lot of brands especially high brands they do very comfortable like a very mm, smooth mattes there's a lot of colors it's 12 colors available a lot of them with a yeah there is a nude there is a lot of uh, uh burgundy color reddish color so i'm sure you can choose something um this is something interesting check it out okay. so let's do another couple of releases and uh it's going to be that's it for today setting release rare beauty releasing a uh true to myself tint and press talc free finishing powder and it blurs and smooths uh, reduces shine and set makeup with light buildable coverage and a natural finish that stays true to you it's coverage light it's natural it's pressed powder diffuse cloud effect that lets radiance filter through no chalkiness caking creasing clogging pores or flashbacks Use alone or over makeup for boosted coverage and shine control. The hard no mass formula make it perfect for touch ups on the go. Thirty dollars each is coming soon. Uh, it's not yet, but it's coming soon on seventeenth. Uh, I think this power uh, basically it's control the oil oilness. I don't know. It's for me. I really don't really use a lot of powders. The only things I can use is transparent powder, which like a banana powder, something like this. Or the, I, my favorite powder is from a Guerlain Meteorite, which is have a satin finish, I would say. So that's powder, I can use it. 
20 skin releasing plush padding intensive recovery lip mask with pomegranate sterols and vitamin e a lip mask with plush a padding like texture that coats lip with super change moisture for a smoother firmed and plumber look uh, in one week that's what we have this mask at how much is that? It's $23 available right now at Sephora. Let's talk about our last uh, sneak peek. It's from Bobby Brown. And he is releasing new foundation with SPF 15 and hyaluronic acid. It's a weightless skill oil control. I guess this is matte foundation. Let's see. An oil co uh, controlling foundation that provides 24 hours moisture and wear, minimizing the look of pores, and it's waterproof and sweat resistant. Medium coverage, natural look, liquidish SPF 15. This lightweight, hydrating, not cacking foundation diminishes the look of oil and day without stripping your skin. Design for a range of skin concern tones and types from oily to dry. It provides medium coverage with a comfortable, breathable feel. It's also waterproof, sweat, humi humidity resistant and resistant to transferring, fading and creasing. Uh, this is interesting. This is also for a dry skin, a natural I matte finish. That's what it is. Medium coverage is shades for all. Yes, so it's natural matte finish. Uh, it's actually interesting. It's 57 American dollars. It's currently on Sephora website. And this is going to be our uh, last items, which is interesting for people, especially who has a oily skin. For me, maybe it's something I'm looking forward like I don't like matte, but I like a neutral finish. So maybe this is like a between. I don't mind, but I don't like really a matte foundation. So maybe it's something to check it out. And I think that's it. Thank you very much to watching me till the end. I hope it was useful for you. I hope you find something interesting. And uh, yes, I already purchased something. So stay tuned. I'm going to do a video about definitely about these two products, the Mario and uh, Yami Skin uh, Concealer. And also I'm going to compare with more affordable one. Like I know maybe it's not fair, but I think they are pretty, pretty the same, but not the same. I think this is, as I mentioned before, more for dry skin, whereas this one, everybody can use it. And another one from L'Oreal. I have a medium also, the glowing one. Let's see, maybe it is kind of similar. So if you don't want to really spend a lot of money, maybe you just substitute with that one and go for more affordable price and i think that's it thank you very much again and i see you soon in my new videos and definitely the traveling i'm going to go soon Paka paka. bye bye have a wonderful and beautiful day depends where you are